I have uh, disassembled the cassette mechanism of the deck and uh, here is uh, so here are the components of the cassette mechanism this is the recording side of the uh, the deck and I have repaired it cleaned it thoroughly and it's now working fine so actually the A side was uh, playing one side and uh, when you switch to the B side of the cassette it uh, it just stopped playing and uh, I disassembled it and thoroughly inspected it and the main problem was this little rubber gear this gear it's you can see there are some broken teeth of the gear so this was causing the B side uh, not to play and these gears are very difficult to find especially this one so this is a rubber gear you can see it can bend it's flexible and it has lost two teeth <laughs> pretty worn out so if uh, a similar fault happens with your cassette player cassette deck then this is the main problem this is the culprit behind the so uh, I will try to find a new gear but it, they are very rare and so here we go so this is the motor and which drives the entire mechanism and this is the main chassis main chassis and uh, mm, so we have a solenoid so when you press the button for example when you play the button this this solenoid it becomes a, an, an electromagnet and it pulls this little metal bar upwards like this and it starts the cassette mechanism so these are the spools and when you play the cassette deck one spool acts as a collector and one acts as a supply spool so uh, it depends on which side you are playing if you are playing the for example left side so this spool acts as a tap collecting uh, spool and this side this spool acts as a supply spool and here we have got belts the belts are mm, good they don't need to be replaced and two belts and uh, these are the pinch rollers so they are in a pretty bad shape and I will clean them I don't see any like abrasions and bits so that once they are cleaned they will work perfectly fine so two of them for playing both the sides and here is the head this is the rotating head it rotates when you are playing the A side of the cassette this is the position when you switch to the B side it rotates 180 degrees 180 degrees and it starts playing the opposite side so the head is also in good shape it needs some cleaning but it's in good shape so I haven't meddled with the alignment screws so this is the factory setting main thing actually this is the cam cycle gear 
which controls the entire mechanism. Uh, while you are, uh, when you are reassembling this entire unit, you have to be very careful. If this cam cam gear, if installed in not properly, then it will uh, the entire mechanism it will just jam and it won't work. If you look th uh, closely, there is a small hole. Do you see? Yes, this one. So this hole must be aligned with this square box opening. So it must be installed like installed this way. It will work fine. If you install it like in a, another arrangement like this way or this way, it will not work. It will jam. Uh, we have the capstans and they have some ferrite deposit also. They need to be cleaned. This capstan, yeah, you can see there is a ferrite deposit. It needs to be cleaned thoroughly. What else? So, I have serviced this side and it is perfectly fine. I will reassemble the unit and if you are interested you can watch that video too.